Hey, what up Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you all doing good. Welcome to my Fallout 76 daily notification video. In this video, I'll notify you about the changes in the Atomic Shop and I also show you the daily challenges and uh, how to complete them if I know how to. So let's stop wasting time and jump right into it. Alright, so let's go and check it out. What's up? By the way, I will have a quick notification once I'm done with the review of the Atomic Shop and the daily challenges. So, let's go and take a look. By the way, I actually received my atoms as well for uh, the monthly Fallout First membership. So in the Fallout First membership, nothing has changed apart from if you have, uh, I, I believe this medical tent is still available. I need to check out on the date when it ends. But anyway, so, uh, the Valentine's Day, I'm actually thinking of getting this bundle just because of the heart. And uh, I will get. I will wait until next Tuesday, so we get like the Atomic Shop update, and uh, see what we got there. If there is anything epic, but man, gotta tell you, 1,200 atoms, just for the heart. <laughs> I mean, I don't think I'll use anything else from here apart from the the balloons, maybe or or this toy. I don't know. We'll see. But anyway. But I am definitely getting the Nuka Cola bundle. That is out of question. This is something I really want to get, and uh, I wanted it. Wait, is this the secret door, right? Uh, Nuka Cola vending machine secret door. Yeah, that's so. Boom! Here we go. I got the door. Yeah, I'm happy. <laughs> All right. Um, and. Okay, this already reviewed all of these sections on the Tuesday video, and this is the Atomic Sale new sale coming this week. Now, the first from the what, the usual. So basically, uh, today, starting off today, um, the Black Handmade skin is ending today. So as I mentioned, uh, tomorrow we'll have the Black Bird paint, and it will last until the next Tuesday with a discount. So. If you're looking into buying this handmade skin, I would highly recommend it to you. I might not even actually gonna grab it right now because I like handmaids. <laughs> yes, sir, I do. And I am planning to switch to the rifle build. Actually, you know what? I'll just wait. Maybe at some point it will give a bigger discount. I'll just wait. I mean, I don't have a lot of atoms right now. But man, uh, I don't know. Okay, I'll think about it. I'm most probably gonna get it. <laughs> There's like a maybe like 90% chance I'm gonna get it because from all the uh, skins of the handmade, I find that one the best one. I had the golden one, I have two options of the golden ones, and that one on my PC character, and I really like the dark one, the black one. So, let's take a look at the daily challenges. Today we got build floors, walls, roofs, and workshop or camp. Okay, very doable, 10 atoms, super easy. Kill rat roaches. Uh, in the toxic valley very easy I'll show you where I find mine and you can kill them as well kill legendary enemy uh, take your chances at the white springs let me show you right here I'll show it to you right now take your chances at white springs and uh, or uh, West Tech Research Center or any Fisher sites Fisher sites sorry uh, Fisher sites and uh, or any others there, there's a really high chance that you're gonna encounter your enemy if you're gonna play a lot today so that is very doable very easy challenge so no problem we'll get it done all right level up while level 76 or higher so basically uh, these are like the sub challenges I'm gonna walk you through right now if you complete uh, three at the same time once you level up you'll get additional 10 atoms on top I don't think I'll be able to do this one today but anyway uh, level up while world 94 level up while engaged in PvP while fed in power armor, yielding a musical instrument as a weapon, in Vatoga, uh, on top of the world in the level 40, wearing unstoppable costume, wearing formal wear, uh, Voltec Research Center on the level 10, and a level up uh, while you're level 76 or higher. Uh, nuclear Winter, who super easy one today as well. Uh, take three photos, you can do that in the lobby and you'll get this challenge completed. You don't even have to play a match, all you gotta do is just log into the lobby, take your shots the photo right and you can exit and you'll get yourself a perk card I'm actually gonna do that today uh, scrap junk produ to produce screws okay so if you're gonna planning to 
play today for a long time, you'll definitely get all the screws. Just pick up all the desk fans, uh, type, uh, type, typing, type, purse, type, ha <laughs> ha! Typing machines. You know, this thing, why, why uh, this happened, I received a comment, why do you call them typing machines? They're typers. Or, yeah, well, I call them typing machines. You know, the things that you use to type. <laughs> back in the day so I'm gonna pick up three typing machines over here let's see what I usually do and white springs so most probably I'm gonna uh, jump over here right now uh, take the typing machines capture that workshop uh, build my pre-made fort and I'll complete the 10 atom challenge then I'm gonna go to white springs find the remaining fans typing machines in hopes to find a legendary enemy kill it get uh, some more atoms on top so let's start doing those atom challenges shall we? all right and just in case you will spawn in this location here what you'll need to do is just run straight and run through the main entrance over here I'll need to turn off those voice things and then you'll see those tents over there so on the uh, that tent or this one I oh, know it's this tent you should find your typing machines and three of them and that's uh, one screw per item so I'm left to find uh, any two more typing machines or a desk fan and I'm pretty much done with my uh, scrapping things to get my screws but the other thing is if you don't have a lot of time to play what you can do you can go to white springs and there are gonna be a whole bunch of vendors over there and all you gotta do is just pretty much buy ah! buy the junk scrap it and get yourself your uh, screws and you're pretty much done so you don't even have to go out there and uh, look for them by yourself man these cockroaches where you going son come back here fly all right so right now we're gonna complete the building one I build my fort and bam I got my atoms so really easy I could have done that at my camp but mm, since I was coming here why not do it in a workshop now I'm gonna show you where to kill the cockroaches so there are a lot more cockroaches in another location I haven't unlocked it I believe it's somewhere here so let me go first unlock it because this is my Xbox character I don't have a lot of locations unlocked I need to play a little bit more adventure mode and I'll show you the exact location exactly where you spawn in and where you find your first three or two four uh, cockroaches and then I'll show you one more location where you find about like two or three cockroaches again so the rat roaches my bad you kill them you get the atoms <laughs> all right so I unlocked the location thank god it wasn't super far away what you'll need to go is the Clark's Burke shooting club this is the location where you'll end up spawning and what you'll need to do is just run through this fence over here down to that courtyard over there and over there you'll see your targets so that's our target number one and over here you can find up to four rad roaches roaches cockroaches cockroaches let's just call these cockroaches rad roaches whatever man so many cockroaches in there. that's two that's three and we should be having another fourth one somewhere here I remember this four of them and that's four so that is very simple done done then you can go into Prickets Fort and on the top of the Prickets Fort you shall find some more cockroaches we gotta find just one take them out and get all right so you will end up appearing right here all you gotta do is just run up like two up basically by the way, there are some houses over here, uh, we can take a sneak peek as well and see if you will be able to find some desk fans or typing machines and if you can, uh, you can complete the challenge by like going to the power, uh, the power plant that I've shown you, you pick up those three desk fans over there, uh, come here and pick them up. I'm not sure, I haven't been spoken around in this area for a long time, I don't remember if there are any desk fans, but I'm pretty sure there should be, I mean people leave here man they gotta have some fans or something you know some typing machines all right so now once you come here all you gotta do is look for the cockroach and cockroaches should be popping out once you come into the buildings I haven't been in this area for a long time I think there should be one behind this door no ah, there you go easy uh, also if you got lock picking uh, there's another cockroach right there as you can see he's uh, kind of a little shy cockroach 
Then there's an one more over there inside that room, but you will need lockpicking skills. Activate it just one and you lockpick that door and you'll get your cockroach. So done and done. I'm gonna go make my white springs run and I hope to find a legendary and get the de desk fan or anything like that and complete the other challenge too. Alright, I completed the word in my challenge and I have another legendary here and another one and another one and I'm gonna die and I'm not gonna die and I don't know and oh my god and wait! <laughs> Believe it or not, but I just killed five freaking legendaries in a row. Oh my god, Furious Power Fist, what's up? one star and there were like one stars and three stars I miscalculated how many three stars I got uh, I think it was like about three three stars but now I gotta find those stupid bodies this is just insane oh man things I'm blowing up which sucks maybe I'm gonna get something good no oh cockroach come on man I saw a three star here too somewhere one of these cockroaches must be a three star because I did kill one Okay, there we go. Forest armor, and it's a two star. Cockroach. And there were a whole bunch of stars over there. Oh my god. Too bad I didn't get a really good power, good power fist. I would sell it, make some good caps. But guess I'm my day. So yeah, that was pretty cool. And the last three star. I mean, I'm not sure where the other star is. Oh, there we go. And... Damn it, just one star. Oh, I didn't get anything good. Usually when I shoot the dailies and I kill a three star, I actually get something good. Well, I'm actually gonna also complete the entire run because uh, having so many uh, stars just in one run, and just from this building, it means that this place is more probably gonna be like uh, filled with... Um, legendary enemies but man that was cool <laughs> alright so I pretty much completed all of the uh, daily challenges including the screws I got the remaining screws in uh, white springs and by the way I did encounter a couple of more legendaries but just one star two star it was a really good run now I can script some uh, so yeah really freaking easy challenges so Z Clan and everybody else you know the drill do you know Forget to leave. This thing is not working. <laughs> oh man, that like. I hope you enjoyed the show. And if you're new and you subscribe, welcome to Zclan. I'm Gamer Z Saul from Ukraine. So hi from Ukraine. Uh, leave your comments down below. Please make sure not to use profanity because those comments get uh, triggered and. Uh, I read them, but I delete them, other users don't see them. The other thing is, thanks a lot for voting for the Patreon. I did set up the Patreon today, I made it go public, so you can find the link in the video description if you want to become one of the Z-Clan Dragons, which here, big thank you for uh, giving me all the support. And I actually got, uh, you know, because I'm at the end of the ending uh, screens of my videos, I'm going to have uh, Z-Clan Dragons uh, with a special uh, thank you as well. Uh, with their player um, sort of screenshot. Well, I'm, gonna, I'm planning this out to make it and we actually got our first dragon today as well uh, before I even announced this. So <laughs> I was a little bit surprised. So I want to make a little shout out here to uh, a greater evil 667. He's become our first Z-Clan dragon. So thank you for the support, for the love. And yeah, that's sort of the announcement. I'm going to have some more information coming uh, with, by tomorrow, some updates on our Discord. I will also make a video uh, onto that to make it a little bit more, you know, informative. I did make the community post about it, and uh, yeah. Wow, I, 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 I need to make a new sort of speech for the end screens or something I don't know but what I have in plan basically uh, those who decide to help this channel uh, by becoming one of the Z clan dragons via patreon uh, basically I'll ask for one your super favorite picture and I will kind of make a rotation of uh, different dra Z clan dragons like I have my little dragon here with wife with my wife he's somewhere here <laughs> I don't think if you can if you can hear him or not <laughs> Uh, Gamer Z Jr. But and uh, they're gonna be rotating with a thank you message, and the anthem th uh, song will be playing 
on the background. The anthem song is being made by one of the Z Clan members as well. And uh, wow, this is epic. <laughs> so, Roby, uh, that's the username of the person who made our Z Clan song. Anyway, guys, thanks all for watching, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye.